there's a clip here from I'm seeing here from the flipping Andrew Schultz and Whitney Cummings. Let's see what this is. What, the, what does this look like? Hopefully, this is funny. Nah, this dude is on drugs. Let's see what this is about. Yo, Whitney looks mad in the face, isn't it? God damn it, girl. Let's see what this is saying. Did I come from? You know, I had seven dollars for seven. Do you years. think people really have an issue with nepotism, or they have an issue with themselves just not getting a role? Hollywood's never been like fair. <laughs> Look why at should it be? That's I mean, it's like look at Andrew Schultz's seven. fade. Look at Andrew Schultz's fade. Only white people can get this fade, you know. Only white people can get this fade. This like non-fade thing where you don't fade it. If you're not white, you can't get this trim. This trim is disgusting. Like, what is this? It's like you left the chair halfway through the haircut. That is fucking insane haircut. An insane haircut. But I've seen it quite often. A few people having this kind of hard line fade feed. You can't get that if you're black. If you're black, you can't get that. It's unacceptable. You just cannot get it. In the slightest. And I also think it just doesn't look good on some white people even. This is a shocking fade, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you think like people really have an issue with nepotism or they have an issue with themselves just not getting a role? Hollywood's never been like fair. Why should it be? Well, that's I mean, thing. it's like neither okay. sports. Now like, this is a this is a fucking wild take that the guys don't really appreciate. I think it's sorry. Can I say something about no, Nicole? No, I was in the middle of a sentence. I know, but if we're I know, on, but we're not moving on. It's about you, this. Okay. It's about this. The Nepo baby's parents. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He gagged her. That was a fucking gag. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a gag. That was a gag. She came in with all the like she came in with all the Adderall, right? And her flipping ketamine that I'm always on. She came in all her stuff. And Andrew Schultz was like, devil get thee behind me you shall not pass devil get thee behind me i'm making my point you shall not pass you shall not pass and i actually wanted to hear what he had to say about nepotism because I, I think he's got a pretty horrible take on it anyway anybody that's made it always has a really terrible take on nepotism because nepotism isn't no one gives a fuck that rich famous kids get opportunities because they're rich famous kids it's more so rich famous kids get all the opportunities and then the other people who are not rich and famous are fighting for scraps that's the issue and if you're just getting your chances based on you know the luck of what family you're born into that is really not the most productive thing or the helpful thing or the best thing for the arts that you're involved in just a common sense thing but anyone that makes it has a really bizarre view on nepotism because oh, I made it, I'm successful. It's like, yeah, but you're one of, you know, very few, mate. The whole reason why nepotism is a bad thing is because it doesn't give people a fair chance to get involved. Anyway, we know why. But this gag, wow. I have to watch it one more time. That was fucking brutal. Whitney, baby, Whitney. <laughs> did I come from? <laughs> Heads that I come from, you know, I had seven dollars for seven. Do you years. think people really have an issue with nepotism, or they have an issue with themselves just not getting a role? Hollywood's never been like fair. Why should it be? Well, that's I mean, thing. it's like neither okay. sports. Now like, this is a this is a fucking wild take that the guys don't really appreciate. I think it's sorry. Can I say something about? No, Nicole, I was in the middle of a sentence. I know, but if we're I know, on, but we're not moving on. It's about you, this. Okay. It's about this. The Nepo baby's parents, <laughs> right? I'll, <laughs> oh that was good i'm not gonna lie that was good man uh, nepotism nepo baby nepotism nepo baby also can we just relax with this nepotism debate it was fun when it was like when it was fun now it's just getting boring like enough enough because it doesn't matter who's making shit now nepotism babies guys on the street everything on tv now fucking sucks movies are terrible books are probably the only decent thing out there but no one really reads everyone's just on their phones talking shit you know getting inundated with fucking bullshit it's a fucking car crash out there comedy isn't great it's all flipping bullshit so maybe let's just focus more on quality i don't care who you are 
if you're the son of whoever let's just focus on quality first i don't care how rich you are whatever you do are you good at what you do yes or no can we get back to that level please can we get back to that society where people are actually good at what they do have some level of talent have some level of interest some level of creativity some level of ability that might be quite nice huh eh? that might be quite nice but fucking hell andrew shots gagged her in another level that i've never seen in my entire life that was actually quite entertaining to watch i'm not going to lie big up andrew shots <laughs> no i was talking <laughs> holy shit wow whitney cummings man anyway <laughs> i think that's it i've got no more left man